it's been reported uh, that, that you've got family links to, to Russia, that your wife apparently has a stake in the Indian IT consultancy firm Infosys. Um, they operate in Moscow. They have an office there. They have a delivery office there. They've got a connection to the Alpha Bank in Moscow. Are, are you giving advice to others that you're, you're not following in your own home? That's not, as a, I, I'm an elected politician and I'm here to talk to you about what I'm responsible for. Uh, my wife is not. She is not, but, but equally, if you, if you, you know, as, as a country, we are asking taxpayers to fund the UK's support for Ukraine. We're asking people in the UK to give their homes up to Ukrainian refugees, whereas it, where it appears your family potentially could be benefiting from Putin's regime. No, I, I really I don't think that's the case. And as I said, uh, the, the operations of all companies are up to them. Uh, we've, we've put in place significant sanctions and all the companies that we are responsible for are following those, as they rightly should, sending a very strong message uh, to Putin's aggression. Do you know if Infosys is? I, I, have, I have absolutely no idea because I have nothing to do with that company. Congratulations on uh, your son-in-law becoming the UK Prime Minister. What, what do you have to talk about? Nothing, but he has become a prime minister. Fine, I'm happy. Not more than that. Have you been watching what's really happening in the UK? I don't do that. I look after my my own country's things. He looks after his country. What was the last conversation you had? Any any political conversation? No, never no. ever. He's always our son-in-law, so I always wish him all the best. Not more than that. I, I have I have absolutely no idea because I have nothing to do with that company. Now this is a story all about how and Rishi got flipped turned upside down. So stick a pound in the meter if you got my spare. I'll tell you how I became a multiple millionaire. In Winchester College, born and raised in the city is where I spend most of my days. Cashing out, maxing, then taxing the poor while helping Tory to keep their money offshore. A hundred plus Tories, they were up to no good. Started throwing parties in my neighborhood. I got one little fine. My wife gets scared. She said, Move in on Boris. Say, My emphasis shares. Boris is a man. It soon became clear that had lied through his teeth throughout his career. If anything, you could say this man was unfit. But I backed him until the right moment to quit. I fall up to number 10 with my bank of tricks But the Tory membership shows What market? The United Kingdom where life isn't fair Now we're back green car Go home to